$1.9 trillion. $1.9 trillion. We're now a nation that is close to $30 trillion in debt. $30 trillion in debt. We would never pay that off. Never pay that off in our lifetime. Our kids won't. Our grandchildren won't. And if we all function this way financially, if we had that kind of spending, we would, we would be homeless. We wouldn't have a house. We wouldn't have a car. We wouldn't have anything. Because we would be broke, right? But Congress doesn't operate that way. This $1.9 trillion Biden blue state bailout, because that's what it is, only 9% of it goes to actual COVID relief. The $138 billion in it that's supposed to help our kids go back to school, save our children, well, only 5% of that actually goes to schools. This in 2021. This is a joke, everyone. It's a complete joke. Why on earth are we spending $1.9 trillion when it does nothing? If anything, the greatest thing we can do for this country is to reopen America. Yes. And put our kids back in school. Yes. Our kids have been the biggest victims of this pandemic. Children who are in the lowest risk group, lowest risk group, have suffered the most. Kids missed prom. What else? High school graduation. Their sports seasons got canceled. Their activities got canceled. Their opportunities got canceled. Their social lives got canceled. School got canceled. They fell behind in their education. And then we have teacher union bosses demanding all this money and all these things in order for, their, for the government paid teachers to go back to work. That is wrong. But I tell you what, this, is, this has been too much for our kids. It's been too much for our kids, and it's been a terrible thing. We don't want anyone to die of COVID. No one wants anyone die, to die of COVID. And thank God President Trump and his administration did Operation Warp Speed and got the vaccine ready so that people who want and need the vaccine can have it, and the rest of us that don't want it can continue on.